So hey guys, um, today I'm going to be showing you fun things to do with your hamster. So, um, this video is going to be me doing it with Muffin. And some things I can't really do because I'm using my computer to demo this, but I'm sorry. Um, so the first thing you can do is obviously just hold your hamster and pet your hamster. And give it lots of love. And that also makes them happy. So you want your hamster to be happy or else you won't have fun. So, yeah. So you can just hold your hamster and pet it and make it happy. The next thing you can do is you can feed your hamster treats. So, um, so I have just a C right here. It's not her favorite stuff, but, um, she didn't eat it. Um, but you can just feed your hamster treats and... Oh, <laughs> what about... She never eats these. She never would dare. But those are just these. Those parts. Oh, then come back. Come back. Thank you. There you go. No. Um, but yeah, you can just feed your hamster treats. And if they do eat it, they do, and if they don't, they don't. So, don't be mad at hamster. Um, the next thing you can do is you can set up a playpen with toys and stuff. I just have this right here. So she can just run around and play on this um, desk, which I've cleared from any wires and things, and it's quite big space. Um, she can just go in the hut and play around, and then she can come out when she wants to. Um, and what I like to do is I like to, um, put, like, a bit of bedding so she doesn't, she isn't so clue, clueless, um, so she'll sniff it and then she'll know it's okay. So, um, yes. Oh, and then if they pee, you got to clean it up. Thank you, Muffin. Um, <laughs> um, yeah. And then you can let them crawl into something. Muffin. And then you can take them. You can take them outside. And there's um, a couple videos by Chocolate Colors 26 and probably Hopping Hammy, I don't know. But um, there's a lot of videos on how to take your hamster safely outside. Um, so I recommend watching all the things you can find because a lot of people, a lot of people's hamsters die or get lost while they're taking them outside. So watch the videos, I promise you. You will need to, <laughs> or else you might be one of those people. Um, just They just get taken by hawks, and they run away into the grass, and they're just gone. So, um, I recommend watching all the videos and stuff like that. And then you can put your hamster into a ball. Muffin really likes her ball. I don't have it with me. It's uh, currently drying. She just got to run in it. But, um, you can put your hamster in a ball, close it up, and let them run around. But please, all these people, um, they just, they, like, put their hamster in a ball, it's secure and stuff. And then they just close the door, they go watch a TV show or something, and their hamster's just alone, running around in the room. Usually they're okay, but I still, Muffin, she likes to escape from her ball. That's why I, um, I always, sorry, I always, um, supervise her, because her ball just comes open. She, like, scratches at it, and then it comes open. Um, if any of you guys know it happens to your hamsters, yes, yes, it is very annoying. Um, um. And that's how your hamster can get lost. So if that happens and you close the room and you're not in the room, um, that could happen and you could lose your hamster. So, yes. And if I lose my hamster, I don't get another hamster. And if I find Muffin, then we have to give her away. Um, same with all my other hamsters if I ever get any more. Um, I can't lose them. If I do and I find them, I have to give them away. So... If that's the deal with your dad, don't do that. <laughs> don't ever do that. Um, uh, 
then what you can do is you can, like, it's not really with your hamster, it's for your hamster, but you can make it toys and treats, and that's really fun. Um, sorry, my hair. If you can count how many times I touched my hair in this video, I'll thumbs up one of your videos. Um, and subscribe to you. <laughs> um, but, yes. So, um, yeah. Another fun thing you can do is... Oh, let me think really quick. Sorry. Should have wrote this down. Jeez, I should have wrote... Oh. Um, you can rearrange your hamster. Um, I don't recommend doing it with an untamed hamster. Never do it with an untamed hamster, in fact, because that is bad. They... Free range is where you just let them crawl around and then you just call their name and they come back with a treat and stuff. Um, and I know hamster horse, hamsters, horses, hamsters, horses, and cats has a really good video on that. And that's how I learned to free range muffin. I don't do it myself because my mom's a little bit, I don't know, 103 times touching my hair. Um, uh, my mom's a little bit. She doesn't really like rodents. She touched, um, she's touched muffin before. That's very brave. Um, um, of her. But she just really doesn't like rodents. And, yes. So, um, make sure it's okay with your parents. Never do it a secret. Because if something does go wrong, then your parents will know you, like, lied or something. Um. But, yes. So, thank you guys for watching. Hope you had fun doing these with your hamster if you did. And, bye. See you in the next video.